I haven't seen. Sorry for blasting you with fire. Hey everybody, welcome back to DDO. It's Vinbus19 here. Uh, today we're moving on to the final quest in the Harbinger of Madness chain. Final edition. I like how they actually titled it that. So we're going into the Harbor Lofts to do the quest in the flesh today. So this is a long... Gotta be careful of a party wipe here, because it could happen. Mind Flare Yell Foon. See, you're getting lo you get lots of XP's out of this quest, no matter what happens. Like, lots of deaths. Worth mentioning, though, on Elite, there are young Beholders in this quest. A variation of Beholder that is not that tough to CR-13, so it's easy to take them out. It's the fight in the, uh... It's the fight in this room. Okay. 
It's the fight in this room here coming up. What? Does it earn? Why hasn't the room opened up yet? This room should have opened up. Oh, it's a breakable door. Okay. I was confused. In the hall of the absurd, you will find former storm reach denizens going about their daily activities. Oh dear. It looks as if they want to play. Please keep them amused until I send someone to clean up. This will help. Something will come out of that door. Oh, well, they took down that poor turret. They put more tape on their misery. Pixel to take some, some parts from you. There's Pixel. So he is a chaos beholder. Death will not be the end of the road for me. Let's kill him from here because he he can kill you all right. Tragic! It will be difficult to replace my favorite eye tyrant, but what a grand show! I do hope you enjoy what I have lined up in the private wing. Two guys here. That guy doesn't aggravate. Say it's 
someone were to die in that fight with Pixel. There's just a shrine right there. There is a fight with... You can... There's an optional to refight Pixel later on. But he'll be tougher the second time. Haunts you until you go in to fight him. How impolite of me to leave the door to the private wing locked. You'll need my personal crest to get in. So my, my player here? They use the glass spider egg sack for that. As soon as you pick up the crest, your simple mind does comprehend what to do. The beholder right? would spawn the like crest right here. Goes in the socket. But because we're on normal, no beholder. I guess this guy just doesn't have what it seems to get out of that room. Now we go back the other way. Oh. Read by a power account. I think there's one on the other side. Yeah, as soon as you pick up the crest. Okay, that door just goes nowhere. Okay, there's the door. Flash renders that I have to Just turn around there. Wait! You'll be the first critic to see my special show before I present it to the Lord of Eyes! Energy aggressor, then proceed at your own risk. 
Hey, can the warning open the door? Yeah, see, so open the door. And there's the dead, there's the Doom Sphere pixel in there. You can't attack them from here. And they'll follow us out. Shit, she's getting hit with anti magic. Shoot him from here. He, unlike his alive counterpart, will not follow us out. Yeah, he's CR 19. Oh yeah, you talk all you want. You're half dead, Pixel. I killed you once, I can kill you again. <laughs> yeah, his alive counterpart wasn't very tough. And he's incorporeal too, because he's a Doom Sphere this time. Yeah, this is just for some extra XP. I'm not killing him for fun. He's undead being low, actually. There. Because it's undead Bane, it'll do more damage. And he is dead. There we go. Now you can see what's funny about a Doom Sphere dying is you can see its eye. Alright, back to the feeding ten bow, I guess. I'll use the feeding ten bow. Right. Why did I summon a turret? Oh yeah, this also helps with the ransack bonus too. Give us the ransack bonus. That helps. Search 11. Oh yeah, there was something back there I never did show you. I call 
this one royalty in repose. No, I didn't use any actual royal flesh, but shh, don't tell it that. You might make it angry. They scaled him down. He used to be like much bigger than that. But the DM narration for y'all fooling in this quest is just all right, overall hilarious. Okay, might as well shrine here. Alright. Head into the final fight. We get it. And here we are with this season's latest in flesh-crafted fashion. A pity you're just going to beat them up. This is why we can't have nice things. Survive this season's latest fashion craft fashions. This is probably the most hilarious thing ever. Top hat. This also gives us the op- I think this is also a end what ends the optional of putting the more taken out of there. Okay, we got seven left. And they all spawned in. And that's the end of the optional. Gotta get this guy and such harsh criticism. No matter. I will find ways to put my creations back together once I disabled you. You do well with an extra eye here, an arm. And there's the old food. Yolthun reveals himself at last. There is a sudden stabbing pain as he overpowers your mind. Everything fades to black. And then the final fight begins. So the way is... The Mind Flayer has brought you to a battleground of his choosing, and you sense a powerful shield surrounding him. A direct assault will likely prove fruitless, so you must find another way. 
Welcome to my mind! You are surrounded by other guests who I have chosen to merge with my superior intellect. Please, do try to resist me. I find it most stimulating. It's like Hagen in this fight. I can see that you will require a more direct approach. Yolthun's attack causes a nearby pod to burst, dispersing the psychic energy stored inside. The Mind Flayer shudders in pain, but you feel a wave of joy as the soul trapped within the pod is free. The Mind Flayer's psychic armor buckles under the backlash caused by his own attacks. You see your opening to it. Magnificent! Such splendid cunning! I will nibble on your memories for days after breaking your will. I'm sure you will be delicious. Clever! That actually hurt! Never you mind, though. I can spare some pods. Pain pods in me. Teleports. How did that? Vulnerable pods appear as Yolthun draws on his psychic reserves. His trap is weakening. Okay, then reverse light gravity happens. My charisma gets too much. Game, don't fucking freeze here. Oh god. Oh, he teleported again. This guy keeps throwing pods too. Do you feel no remorse for destroying my life's work? How uncivilized! I cannot allow you to get away with that, you annoying little creature! As Yolthun is preparing himself for a massive attack, three fragile pods sprout from the floor in front of him. Yeah, that attack would part will kill us if not careful. Defeated, sputtering gibberish incomprehensible even to the natives of Zoriat. And 
that's the, the quest. Nice. We beat ya, we beat ya, we beat ya, we beat ya. Okay, so that was the quest in the flesh. How long did that take? That took 29 minutes. Well, shit. Um, yeah. <sighs> we even fought the Doom Sphere Beholder, which gave us a lot of extra XP. Next time, on DDO, we start something new. <laughs> Collect both of our rewards. Okay guys, this drop, both these drops here, Beholder Plate Armor and Docent. Um, one of these two can drop also in the quest of the Lord of Eyes, and we just got them as a reward for completing this chain. We're gonna get the Beholder Plate Armor as a toggle. Does this one... I don't care if it's full plate armor. It will work. Because I think I trained myself to use full plate. Okay. I don't think I need a search 11 necklace. Alright, thank you all for watching. Leave a like and subscribe. Links to my, me are, my other social medias are down below, and peace!